Hey everyone, it's the Angry Honey Badger here, and it's time for Q&A, which is questions and answers. You ask the questions, I give the answers most of the time. Um, haven't done one of these since June. It's been a while. I'm sorry about that. Um, I just kind of, it kind of got away from me. I'll just put it that way. I just kind of forgot a little bit. So I apologize, but now we will do them. I asked for some questions over Twitter and on Facebook. If you don't follow me on either of those, I suggest you do, so you know about things and where to ask me questions. Although, if you have any questions for the next episode, because we're going to try to do this a little bit more often than every five months, you can put them in the comments, and I'll see them there, and I will answer them next time. So, until then, we're going to go ahead and look at some of these comments. Typically, these comments, or these questions, are non-league related. If you have league questions, you can ask me those um, by sending me a message probably on Facebook or either on YouTube itself and label it as League Talks. And we will do those for the League Talk series, which I do still mm, not as often as I used to, but we'll still get to those when we get good questions is when I answer them. If you have like a really weird question like, I'm stuck in Bronze 5, what do I do? Like that's just a little too generic. But if you have a question about like split pushing, how it works, or what should I do in this situation, or something like more... more just a little bit more meatier, something I can talk about, then that will work. But other than that, these are non-league related questions. We're gonna go ahead and try to find the non-league related questions, although we got a lot of questions. But we'll go ahead and stop, start off with a few today. First one comes in from someone I actually know, and this is them just being silly, but I'll answer it anyways. It's from Happy Lee Aaron, if you don't know about her. Um, she's a friend of mine. She has a anime channel. She does anime reviews and does the manga podcast, if you know who I'm talking about. High five. If you don't, you can check that out. Anyways, ask, how much do you love me for introducing you to Thai iced teas? Like, out of a scale of, I don't know, out of 10, like, probably like a nine and a half. Because Thai iced teas were amazing. And I had never had one until I went to LA um, earlier, earlier this year. So, and uh, we got Thai iced teas. It was amazing. So, yes, lots of love. Thank you for that. Very happy about that. Anyways, the next question... I was from Corey, and they ask, what made you want to be a great YouTuber? Uh, I don't really think of myself as a great YouTuber, I just think of myself as a YouTuber. But, uh, I guess we can get into why I became one if you don't know. I think I answered this one time, maybe. Um, I uh, actually started making YouTube videos because of another person who made League content. I didn't really think, I thought they did an okay job, but I was like, I think I could do better than them. Like, I think I could make better content. So it just kind of was like a personal challenge to myself. And uh, I think my content was better. And my main goal was like, ah, oh, well, let's just see if I can never get as many subscribers as them. And I did pass them eventually, and they actually quit doing videos themselves. So, um, yeah. So that was kind of my main reason for becoming a YouTuber. Um, if you think I'm a great YouTuber, thanks. Um, <laughs> I'll keep trying. I'm going to keep doing it for now until I get sick of it or bored with it or I don't know. I'll just keep doing it. I like it. I get to meet lots of cool people too. That's another thing. Um, here, I'll make up a side question. Um, like, actually, I won't. I know this question's in here. I saw it for a split second. Somebody asked me who my favorite YouTuber was. Look at this. We're relating questions. Amazing. Um, well, from YouTube, I've met other YouTubers, which is cool. And uh, that's one cool thing about YouTube. Um, who my favorite YouTuber is? Oh, let me see who I'm even subbed to. Um, my favorite YouTuber is probably Dodger. I think she's hilarious. Um, so, yes. That's probably her. It was really fun doing a video with her. I did a video with her, if you don't know about that. Um, we played League. Actually, I, I, I kind of coached her in League. Um, that was fun. So, she's probably my favorite YouTuber. I like a lot of other YouTubers, too. Um, and I'm friends with some YouTubers. Like, I'm, I obviously know her fairly well. Um, I know Happy Lee Aaron, who's a YouTuber. Um, or even people just involved with YouTube, like Chad, who's on the network, who does Chad Chomp during the Daily Bite. Chad's hilarious. I know Chad pretty well. Um, so, I mean, I just, I've got to meet some cool people. Um, everybody, if anybody remembers Lane... Um, from when he used to do lane talk, what are they called lane talks? I can't even remember what they were called. Anyways, but uh, when he used to do what is the Daily Bite now and what was Remag, whenever he did that show, I know I don't know him super well, but I've met Lane. Lane's a cool guy. 
um, and just some other cool people. So, um, yeah, I think that's one other cool thing. When I just go out to L.A., and whenever I do anything, getting to see other YouTubers and running into them is hilarious. So, um, yeah, so that's that's cool. Uh, but, yeah, favorite YouTuber? Probably Dodger. Um, I also do like uh, Total Biscuit a lot. Whenever he goes on rants, I usually agree with him like 90% of the time. So it's fun because he like makes the videos I wish I could make sometimes about like just community stuff and all types of things. So um, yeah, stuff like that. Those are some of my favorites. So yes, more questions. Let's find some. I have to, I, I really don't have anything lined up. I'm just going to look and see what is here and what we're doing. And while we look, I'm going to drink some, some G Fuel because sponsorship moment. More like a thirsty moment, but yeah, that's going to happen. Um, if you could own a pet honey badger, what would you name it? Asks Stephen Stacy. Well, if I owned one, I would hope I have a very strong cage because of that's kind of scary. And then what I would name it? Probably something tough sounding like uh, Rasputin or maybe Leviathan which really doesn't make sense, but maybe something like that. Uh, or maybe something really not scary, like just something stupid. Like, I don't know. I'd go with something probably mean sounding. So, um, yeah. But I don't own a honey badger because I would probably die. But that would be fun. Who knows? Anyways, uh, let's see what else we got that's non-league related. Once again, we're going for non-league, hopefully. It's kind of what we're, we're looking for. The other ones, although like all these are league related questions. Um, if you die in Canada, do you die in real life? Y yes. <laughs> That's a weird question, I guess. Um, yeah, interesting. I, I usually don't think about dying in Canada because I'm not in Canada too often or ever. Um, let's see what else we got. Uh, da, 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 While we take a break, I will also eat peanuts because why not? What type of music do you listen to or do you like? What do you think of the band Rise Against and Eminem? Um, I actually listen to a lot of music, or at least a lot of different types of music. Um, I don't know if anybody's asked me this. Um, I can't. It's hard to really say who favorites are if I have favorites. We're gonna see what I let's see what I said my favorites are. We're just gonna open all types of tabs on my computer, and then I can list some stuff I listen to. Oh, as for Rise Against and Eminem, um, I saw Rise Against once when I was uh, I think they opened for My Chemical Romance way back when I was in high school, um, and uh, yeah, they were okay. I used to like them more. I don't really care for them anymore, or at least as much as I used to. Um, so yeah, there's that. Um, Eminem used to like him when I was in middle school. I don't like him at all anymore. Don't don't really care for Eminem. Um, there's other people I'd rather listen to. Um, as for my favorite type of music, generically I'd say rock, but obviously there's many extensions of rock. Like you get into metal, you get into alternative, you get into like ska, you could get into Screamo. I mean, there's all types of stuff. So what I'm going to do is name artists that I posted that I apparently like on Facebook. So I'm just going to start reading these. These aren't in any order, but these are bands I listen to. I'm going to read the ones that I actually do listen to. So Circa Survive, um, Knife Party, Apathy, Self-Titled, Sky Eats Airplane, Five Iron Frenzy, Alien Ant Farm, Muse, All That Remains, Poets of the Fall, The Streets, um, mm, Fall of Troy, Dead Poetic, Flyleaf, Pendulum, Sublime, Under Oath, Copeland, uh, who else is in here? Coheed and Cambria, As Cities Burn, Mastodon, O Sleeper, August Burns Red. Why is it repeating artists? CKY, that's weird, I don't know why it's doing that. Um, Emery, Queens of the Stone Age, Chevelle. Falling Up, Death Cab for Cutie, May, Incubus, Mute Math. That's actually probably a good way to summarize it up. So if you know those bands, those are some ones I listen to 
frequently or fairly often. Oh, actually, there isn't one in there that I've listened to a lot of. Styles of Beyond. I've um, been listening to a lot of that. I have to mention it, obviously. Um, so, yeah. Um, if you know some of those artists, I listen to them. If you haven't heard of them, you can look them up and see if you like them. Some of them, that's, I mean, that's that was a fairly diverse group of uh, musicians there. That was metal. That was rap. That was some other weird stuff. So, yeah. Those are some of the artists I listen to. That's some of the music I listen to. And that's some of the stuff I game to, actually. Um, so, yeah. That is what's up. Um, this is kind of league related. Do you live stream or will you live stream? Um, I used to, but the internet's been so horrible lately, I can't. So I'm hoping that it's, it's actually been getting a little bit better recently, but it was so bad I couldn't actually hold a connection. So that was a problem. And uh, yeah, that was a huge problem. So yes, I will hopefully start streaming in the future again. It's just the internet was horrible. So um, that's kind of the problem that I had at least. So yeah, streaming. Do you play any console games? Um, I sold my Xbox uh, in the summer, earlier this summer, and uh, I think I have an Xbox One reserved. I'll probably pick it up. I don't know if I'm going to play it, though. We'll see. Um, out of either of the consoles that are coming out, uh, I'd play probably games on the Xbox One. There's really nothing exclusive on the PlayStation I care about. Because as much as you're like, well, there's this game or this game, well... Even even when I'm like gonna buy this Xbox, I'm like, what am I even play on it? Because I can play any of the stuff I want to almost currently on PC. So um, right now I have a Dreamcast, that's cool, um, and I might borrow a PlayStation Three from a friend again just so I can play Crash Bandicoot or finish that up because I was doing that on a series on my other channel, um, Badger and Friends. So uh, yeah, maybe we'll try to get that back because I think he just picked up his PS Four. So maybe we'll do that. Hmm. Yeah, we might have to do that. That'll be fun. Anyways, that's most of the questions. Everything else is about League. Not that it's a horrible thing, but if you have, like, good League questions, obviously we'll use those for League Talks. We just don't get as many good questions for that as I used to anymore. If you have questions for me, um, you can leave them in the comments below. Uh, if you have a generic question that you maybe think is already answered, go watch the other questions and answers. You might learn something there. I don't know. Anyways, that's going to be today's. Uh, thanks for the questions you guys sent in. Obviously, that was awesome. And uh, if you have questions, like I said, put them down below. We'll talk about them next time. Other than that, I'll just see all of you guys later. Have a good evening or day, whatever time of the day it is when you watch this.